All right. All right, Stephen, great to see you, meet you in Cape Town. Uh, can you please introduce yourself and tell us where you are? Sure, I'm in, in Cape Town at the Grand Parade in Cape Town um, at a structure that we built here that showcases uh, some green living um, for the World Cup in, uh, in Cape Town. All right. Can you tell us about your job as the architect? Um, well, I'm not the architect, I'm the project manager, um, but also I came up with a concept and I approached an architect to work with us to help build this, this, this building. Um, the architect, Andre, was here earlier on, he's left, um, but the, the two of us uh, basically put this one together, yeah. All right, and in terms of the, the manager, what is your role here, what are you doing? Well, I basically, I've got to pull in the different components that make this project work. So we've got to work with guys, timber experts, um, guys in the botanical field, uh, scaffolders, engineers, architects, um, guys who are doing the posters for us, the lighting has been handmade. So it's basically just pulling all of those different things together. It's like a recipe mix, and uh, you've got to make the cake. Um, so I, I guess I'm, I'm, I'm the cook in a way. Now, have you, have you built, have you uh, baked a similar cake before? Can you hear me okay? I hear you. <laughs> yeah, I know, that's good. No, I've done this a couple of times. We've uh, built a lot of structures, but um, not temporary and not on the middle of a main road in Cape Town. Um, so this was a bit of a, a different one for us. But essentially, um, you know, we've built um, eco uh, touching earth lightly type structures for different conservation agencies. Um, and it's pretty much with that experience that we got the, uh, well, I think that we were chosen to build what we built here. All right. Um, what was the most challenging aspect of making the facility as green as possible? Uh, definitely the timeline. Hey? We, um, we put our idea in about um, five months before the World Cup and we got told that uh, it was on two weeks before uh, the, the gates opened of the World Cup and, and then we had to wait for the road to get opened. And they only opened a road here on which the structures built five days before the World Cup. So the whole thing we, we built in four and a half days. Um, and that by far was the most difficult thing for us to do. Yeah. My, my, my. I'd love to see the time-lapse video of that. That, that. that sounds like a TV yeah. show. Yeah, I know. But, um, but uh, you know, it's one of those stories where everyone pulled together. Um, the guys came on board. We worked through the night. Um, and literally as the gates opened, we were putting the finishing touches there. So it, it, uh, it was tight, but we did it fine. Excellent. How's it? Uh, I hear from, I hear from uh, Kurt that the view from the roof is great. Yeah, no, it is great. It's really, it's a special thing, you know, you're standing on the top of this roof overlooking uh, the city that you live in and you're seeing things from a completely different perspective. Um, and what you're doing here is also, you know, special and it, mean, it's, it means something to us. Uh, everyone that's involved in this project is doing it more for, um, you know, for a love of, of, of a common cause, you know, not just uh, as, as a structure. So everyone's heart's in it and um, yeah, it's a memorable time, you know. One day, not too soon away in the future, we're going to have cars driving exactly where we're standing, you know, and it'll be traffic as usual. Um, so it's a special time to be here and a special location for sure. Beautiful. Anything else you want to add and tell the world? Uh, just uh, if you, you can't see this thing uh, because you're too far away, um, have a look at some of the photographs or go to our website. Uh, touchingtheearthlightly.com that's www.touchingtheearthlightly.com uh, we've posted pictures up here for you guys to have a look at so you can be a part of it hey thank you very much alright man ciao